The navigation menu for the EcoPreserve site is very clean, including only four main options, though they have many more pages on their site. Even though they've paid special attention to detail in their navigation, they certainly can see the forest for the trees, especially because they have many pictures of trees on their site. How'd they do that? When you create your site, you're given one to three pages automatically to start. You can add as many pages as you like using the rather appropriately named Pages tab. Click the plus to add a page. There are a number of different page options, but standard page is the one you'll use 99% of the time. Give your new page a name and select any options for the look and function of the page. Each page you create will be added to your list and automatically appear in your navigation menu. You can rearrange the order of the pages by clicking and dragging them up or down in the list. And dragging a page to the top of the list will make that page your home. As you arrange pages, they're reflected in your navigation. Create a subpage by dragging a page under and to the right of another. In this example, we have home, about, research, and take action. We've placed subpages underneath three of these main options to better organize the site. Now what if you want the navigational menu to stay the same, but don't want this top level page to be accessible? Select the page and click Make a Navigational Menu. Now it exists as a menu, but visitors can't access the page itself. Note that you can switch back at any time, and the only page you can't make a navigational menu is your home. If you want to hide a page from the navigation bar entirely, simply check the box Hide in Navigation. Visitors won't be able to see it in the menu, but you can always create a link to this hidden page from somewhere else on your site if you want to do so. And that's how you do that.